Have you ever gotten frustrated with someone because you know what's best for them, but they keep pursuing the wrong things? They keep uh, falling back into old patterns that will be destructive for them. And perhaps even others are leading them astray in this. And you're, you just want to grab them and say, no, don't go that way. Uh, this, this is what we see the Apostle Paul. This, this is his mentality in this next passage that we see uh, on Sunday. He says, I, I feel like I, I'm just afraid that I've labored in vain. Like everything I'm pouring into, the, the, the ministry that I have, uh, does it matter? Uh, are you listening? Do you care? You know I know what's best for you. Um, and yet you keep falling back. You keep turning uh, to those things that don't matter. Uh, that's what we see the Apostle Paul wrestling with. Maybe, maybe we felt that as, as we come alongside others. And, and may, or maybe even ourselves, we, we have fallen back to what's comfortable, what we know, instead of what's better. Uh, th- this Sunday, we're going to be looking at uh, Galatians 4, uh, 8 through 11. Um, and as, as we look at this passage, I, I just... I pray that God will use it. I think it's it's a perfect time of year uh, as we think about looking ahead and, and not looking back to those those former things um, at the, the turn of the, the new year here. And so I hope that you can join us uh, this Sunday uh, at 1030. We, we won't have ETS time, just uh, this service in the morning. So come this Sunday at 1030 as we look at the message, Don't Go Back. I hope you can join us.